Hi everyone, my name is Maria. I work in the testing lab here at Spectral. In this video, I will show you how you can improve your efficiency in metal testing. By the end of this video, you will understand the necessary steps to perform a standard compliant metal test, the differences between the instrument options and also how an automated sequence maximizes testing efficiency. If you want to test a polymer, for example, you need to know at what weight and temperature and of course according to which standard the material must be measured. When using conventional extrusion plastometers, then you have to control the volume of the polymer and also the pre-eating phase sequence so that the measurements start in the exact window specified by the standard. Please note that pre-testing is necessary to ensure accurate control when testing new polymers. Then, only once pre-testing is complete, you can configure and start the test. Hi Maria, I have a new material that I would like to test. Is there an easier way to do this? The new HTM D1238 standard now allows the use of force-controlled extrusion plasmometers. With that, you and also you, Valenti, have access to not only more, but also brand new possibilities. Let me show you. First, I open the pre-programmed standard test program. Then I enter the temperature and respective test lot. Now, all I have to do is add five grams of polymer. Then I simply press start for a 100% standard compliant test with optimal parameters. Wow, this is so easy and fast, and pre-tests are not necessary anymore. Yes, our A-flows makes you and also you, Valentin, a test expert right from the start. <laughs>